We're back to give you the legal edge. Where did the summer do drivers need to watch out for kids walking to and from? They also need to keep an eye out for school buses. Attorney Brian Waldman of the Sinus Dreamus Law Firm is here for you now with a reminder on the laws that apply to school buses. This is a very important topic. We've covered it many times and it's also obviously very misunderstood. I see people violate this law all the time and actually get angry with people that are following the law. So what's the law? When a school bus puts on its flashing red lights, that immediately means that traffic in both directions have to come to a stop. They have to come to a stop at least 20 feet away from the school bus, and they have to remain stopped until those flashing red lights are turned off or the school bus starts moving again. The only exception to that rule is if there's a barrier like a boulevard or a guardrail in the road that divides the, the lanes of travel going in opposite direction, the people traveling opposite the bus don't need to come to a stop. It's a civil infraction. If someone violates that law, it, it will result in three points going on their driving record with the Secretary of State, and it'll also be a fine. Now, in October of 2021, we also had a law in Michigan take effect that says that those buses can now be equipped with cameras. And the specific purpose of putting cameras on school buses is to catch people who aren't stopping for school buses. And under that law, the citation will be issued to the person whose vehicle, they obviously see the authorities see the plate, the ticket will be issued to the person whose vehicle is being used and it's presumed that they are the driver. Meaning that when they go to court, if they wanna fight the ticket, they will have to prove, they've got the burden of proof that they were not the one driving the car. But again, obviously a very, very important statute just for the safety of students and children. Good reminder. Thanks, Brian.